This is street food heaven in Thailand. Bangkok, arroy chi chi. Fish sauce, sugar. Palat. Palat. Nampa. 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 Are you from Thailand? No, I'm from Cambodia. Oh man, Cambodia, I love your country. It's beautiful. Oh, it's fried. Okay. I'll take these ones. This I like one, these ones, this yeah. One, this one 100 baht. 100 baht? Okay. I'll take one order. Look guys, this is what a cricket looks like. This here is pure protein and it's fried. All right. What's up everybody? Welcome back to another night here in Bangkok, Thailand now. Thailand. Right now. My menu. <laughs> <laughs> we uh, we uh, found the best moto taxi in Thailand. Motorbike. Sorry for the the harsh start guys but we're jumping on the back of a moto taxi right now and i'm taking you guys to go and explore the best night market here in thailand in bangkok i should say yes time to eat thai food thai food papaya salad pad kaprao you like pad kaprao tom yum tom yum gorang oh my god oh oh how many years you drive moto taxi? I guess he didn't understand that one. He's a professional. How many years you've been driving? Driving? Yes. So. <laughs> I said to you, I said to you. Okay. Okay, said to me, Deal, deal. <laughs> reo, reo. <laughs> reo, reo <laughs> means fast, fast. <laughs> In time. No, no fast. <laughs> no, it's okay. Slow, slow. Wow. I'd rather get wow. there. Wow! Wow! Yo, this guy's a character. How do you uh, always get lucky with the best moto taxi guys? I have guys? my friend here. He lives. He lives. He lives. You speak good English. Okay. <laughs> I don't know, but this is crazy, man. <laughs> this is the fastest way to get around around this time, though. It's bumper to bumper traffic. If you take a regular taxi, you're not getting anywhere, guys. Trust me. All right. <laughs> You're not scared? <laughs> <laughs> oh man, this street is popping. Look, they got some uh, pork belly hanging right here. All kinds of other street food hang over in this corner. Some coconut pancakes. Oh, wow. Yo, Thailand is a vibe. Bangkok is a vibe. There's food absolutely everywhere, guys. Oh man, and where do you even start? <laughs> and motorcycles. And I to do what? We love Thailand. Bangkok, Arroy Chi Chi. Arroy Chi Chi. That means um, very, very delicious, but it also means like very, very good um, the way that I use it. <laughs> okay. Oh, are you taking the main street now? All right. We're in good hands. I trust this man. Okay, yeah, the street market. Any man who takes me to food is a good friend. Okay, so this here is the street night market. We're approaching now, and you'll see here why this is my favorite market in Bangkok. Oh, your friend work here. Awesome. Look at the tuk tuk, guys. Yes, right here. Thank you. Oh man, there's nothing better than whooping around the streets of Bangkok in a moto taxi. No way, this is VIP. Especially with two people on it. It's a little nerve wracking, but it's a great experience. No guys, don't try this at home, please. <laughs> Not at home, try it in Bangkok. All right. Wow, this is VIP. <laughs> woo woo. VIP access. Oh my Dang, God. he dropped us off at the market. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you, my friend. All right, here. You said 60? Oh, do you have 100? Yes. Here, I give you 100. For you. For you, my For friend. You. Uh, uh, Facebook, uh. Oh, you want my Facebook? Here. That's oh that's her card? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. No. Let me see it. Look, lovely, lovely, lovely. Thank you so my much. Friend. My friend. And my that's friend. my Facebook. 
Thank you. Take care, bro. I like Doraemon. Oh, yeah. Doraemon. Yeah, thank you, bro. Oh, man. Thailand is amazing. Dude, there's a reason why they call this place the land of smiles, and that's because everybody's always smiling. That was the best way to pull up to the pull up to the night market. You feel VIP, don't you? It was so nice. Oh. Amazing. Yeah, we're VIP. <laughs> Alright guys, well, right now I'm about to show you guys one of my favorite night markets here in Thailand. This here is Rachida the Street Night Market. And it takes place every single night. Um, however, on the weekends, it is definitely a lot more popping. So, you're gonna find all kinds of goodies here. Everything from handcrafted items to souvenirs, t-shirts, clothing, and this massive dog statue that I wish I knew why it was here. A little bit of history. It kind of reminds me of like the Hachiko statue in Tokyo, except like a thousand times the size. But there is no story to this one, at least not that um, I'm aware of. But it is a nice looking dog. And uh, it's actually called Rachida the Street Market because it's located right outside of the streets. Now, just down the road is actually the Jods Fair Night Market, which is by far the most popular in the entire city. But, what's up guys? Hello. Hello. Are you guys doing karate? Jiu Jitsu? Jiu-Jitsu? Oh, okay, Taekwondo. That is nice. Enjoy your night. Um, but yeah, the Jods Fair Night Market is down the street, um, and it's the most popular one. However, I must say, I'm not the biggest fan of Jods Fair Night Market simply because there's always way too many people there, if I must be honest. It's gotten super, super trendy um, since the, uh, well, when, once the country opened up from the pandemic when we first came back to Thailand after not being here for several years. Man, the market was very chill, it was very calm, there was live music, but it was a nice place to walk around. However, we visited last night and man, completely different story. It is crowded. There are thousands of people there every single night. So this here is a lot more of a, of a chill vibe, a lot more of my vibe. So yeah, look, you can get nice clothing, shirts, all kinds of socks. Are you doing shopping? <laughs> She's making fun of the way I talk. This isn't nice, you know that? I'm not making fun of you. No? Alright. She's just mocking me. She's mocking me. Smells like papaya salad. I think we should kick this food tour off with some papaya salad. So we're not actually gonna be doing too much shopping here tonight. We came to try some street food. That's what Bangkok is famous for, and it's found everywhere, and night markets are very much part of the culture here in the city of not only Bangkok, but all around Thailand. All right, we should probably find out where that papaya salad is coming from. I think it's coming from here. Hello. Sawadee ka. Oh, this is the amazing papaya salad that I keep smelling. <laughs> What's the price of the papaya salad? How much? 60 baht. 60 baht? Okay, can I get one? A little spicy, please. In Thailand, when you say little spicy, it's still very spicy. <laughs> oh, the market's slow today, huh? Not many people. It's busy on the weekend. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think they understood that one. Now, papaya salad is one of my favorite Thai dishes because it's very refreshing. It actually consists of, um, I believe this is green papaya, right? Like not papaya that is ripe yet, but it's a shaved papaya, a whole lot of lemon, as you can see, he's chopping up right now. A whole lot of chilies, uh, cucumbers, carrots, tomatoes, Sugar. A lot of sugar. Yeah, they put a lot of sugar. But in Thai food in general, they put a lot of sugar into the food. All right. Now, if you guys have never tried papaya salad, you need to find a, a Thai restaurant near you and get your hands on some right away because it is delicious. All right. 
wait, wait, wait. It's about to get bagged up. Let's see, let's see what the papaya salad looks like all bagged up. Can you help me out, Gladys? Can you get a hundred out of there? A little spicy. <laughs> yeah, just one. Oh, is that that's not mine. That's too spicy. Yeah, just just two chilies. All right. I had a feeling that um that was not my papaya salad because they put a little too many chilies in that one. Is that fish oil? Yeah, fish oil is used. What is this? That's sugar. Oh, okay. Fish sauce, sugar. Palat. Palat. Nampa. 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 <laughs> okay. I really need to brush up on my on my Thai. All I know is um, Sawadi Ka and Kapun Ka. And Haroi Chin Chin. Haroi Chin Chin. Papaya salad, Haroi Chin Chin. Okay, so now he's gonna chop up some tomatoes. Oh man. And this is the papaya, the green papaya. Okay, yeah, yeah, me <laughs> Oh man, this smells amazing. Definitely a great way to kick off any food tour here in the city. And then it looks like over in this direction they actually have some crabs. What is this for? Crab salad? Three for one hundred. Three for one hundred? Yeah. How do you eat? Oh, you cook? Yeah. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, please. Thank you. Here you go, I pay you now. I can't say I really want to try the crabs. Uh, Gladys probably wants to try the crabs. Do you want to try them? Uh, not right now. I'm craving the papaya salad. It smells so Yeah, delicious. papaya salad is next level. You can't go wrong. You can't go wrong, or can you? No, you can't. Actually, you know what? I've had one bad papaya salad. Oh, guys, I forgot the peanuts. Man, don't play with me. This is amazing. Thank you. Kapun Kap. Wow, guys, look at this beautiful creation here. All right, guys, well, we secured the papaya salad. Now we got to find a nice little spot to eat this papaya salad um, where there's still some light. You know what? Let's do it right here, babe. We're going to eat this right here because then the other spots get a little bit too dark. All right, you know what? I'm going to let you do the honors first. Oh, really? Ladies first, ladies thank first. You, Remember you. that, gentlemen. Ladies first. Oh, no, my Unless my it's a nice water. big steak with potatoes. Oh, I then love big steak. You go first, gentlemen. Okay. <laughs> mm. Is that bussin'? <laughs> this one smacks hard. Yeah. That's bomb? Let me try this. As long as it's not too spicy, I'm okay with it. But I'm telling you, they don't play with the spiciness here in Thailand. Sometimes it's a little bit, it's brutal, guys. Mm. <laughs> oh my God, it's very I saw spicy. You, on Facebook. you saw me on Facebook? Yeah. Oh, thank you so much. You here all the time? Not all the time, but I love coming back here. I know. I saw you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Some pictures. Take you want to take a picture? Yeah, let's oh. take one. Why not? Hey, oh, my mouth is on fire right now. <laughs> I like Thailand that much. I love Thailand. One, two, three. Okay. There he goes. Thank you so much. Vietnam and everything. Yeah. Yeah, I saw one episode. He went to Vietnam airplane. Didn't let you record it because there were girls lining. Yeah, there was girls everywhere. Oh. That's one of my my biggest videos, actually. Yeah, because they, they have to hide. <laughs> Thank you so much. I appreciate oh, it. Nice meeting you. Take, Take care. care. Enjoy the food. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Oh man, good thing she distracted me. I was about to shed a tear. But I love meeting you guys all the time, man. It makes my heart full, and that's the beautiful thing about YouTube, man. It connects such a big world. And it makes it almost feel small because now I'm just like navigating around and I'm meeting people not only back at home in a place where I barely make videos, but 
men in India, in Sri Lanka, in Thailand, in Hong Kong, there's people on the streets recognizing me and man, that's amazing. It's an amazing feeling. So I'm super grateful for all you guys. But yeah, this papaya salad, yo, it hits, but it's a little bit on the like tangy sour side and then extremely spicy. And he only put one chili in there. The lady before me got like four in there. Dog. So, gotta be careful out here. Can I take you with photos? Yeah, bro. Yeah, Have I, you seen the videos too? I seen your video of crazy, crazy night in Siemens. Yeah. yeah. Thanks, bro. I appreciate yeah. it. Here, actually. Oh, you know what? Well, like, she can take the photo for us. Yeah. Are you from Thailand? No, I'm from Cambodia. Oh, man, Cambodia. I love your country. Yeah. It's beautiful. Okay. Here, let's take one like this, yeah. Thank you, sir. Hey, I appreciate you. Nice to meet you, thank you. Akon. That's thank you, right? Akon. In Cambodia, in, Cam in Khmer. No, in Khmer, Akon. Thank you. Akon. Akon. Thank you so much for watching my videos. I appreciate you. Oh, man. Do you want me to hold it? We're just getting you? started and I've already met so many of you guys. This is awesome. Yeah, you know what? Um, I'll let you keep destroying that. Let's go get something to drink now, right? Yes. Oh man, that? No joke. That was brutal. Thank you. That was brutal. Oh man. All right, so we got a Thai lady um, that came and said hi. We got a guy from Cambodia. That's what I'm talking about, guys. This place is awesome. All right. You know what? Now I think we're actually gonna go with. Let's get something refreshing. Hello, how are you, sir? You have coconut smoothie? Okay. Or what is this one? That's just water, coconut water. Coconut shake. Okay, I'll do one coconut shake. Um, let's do a small one, please. Thank you. Oh, so they do fresh coconut juice coconut shake and then you can actually buy the whole coconuts for 50 bucks no coconut ice cream here no that's one of my favorites all right i love how here in thailand they put the big chunks of pulp from the coconut inside of the juice How much is the smoothie, sir? 35. There you go, 40. Thank you. It's okay, thank you. Oh, I know Gladys needs that coconut shake right now, huh? Hey, the papaya salad is very delicious. It's on the spicy sides of things, but the flavors, it's there, it's good. Thank you, sir. Very spicy, but I cannot stop eating. Oh, man. Coconut smoothie. Spicy. Man. <laughs> They hit the spot. And that got a nice amount of coconut chunks in there too as well. You taste that? Here, I'll hold, I'll, I'll help you with the papaya salad. It's okay. You got, you sure? I wanna keep eating. It's just. Oh, I almost choked on a piece of that coconut. It's spicy, but mm. Oh man, should we try some bugs? You want some bugs? Don't look at me. <laughs> Let's see what they got over here. They got the, um, all kinds of worms, crickets, Oh, these ones are good though. These these are like the um. Remember we had them in Chiang Mai. Mhm. Mm and then Chinatown. these, I think you had one of these in um Venezuela. Yeah. Hello, sir. How much are these? This one, one hundred and this sixty baht. Which one's the most popular? Which one's the most popular one? <laughs> this one. Most famous. This one? Yeah. What is it? Oh, it's fried. Okay. I'll take these ones. This I like one, these ones. This yeah. One, this one 100 baht. 100 baht? Okay. I'll take one order. We're going to try these worms right here. Now, they actually taste like um, they taste like potato chips. They're really delicious and a lot of the locals like eating them with beer. So, you got a nice chang or uh This this goes good with chang, huh? <laughs> Perfect with beer. All right. Can I try this one? I could try that one? Yeah. What is this one? A cricket. A cricket? Okay, I'll try a cricket. Why not? Thank you. 
Thank you, sir. Um, no, no spicy, please. I can't do no more spicy today. Thank you so much. I could just try one? All right, well, why not? Look, guys, this is what a cricket looks like. This here is pure protein, and it's fried. All right. Yo, that tastes like a sunflower seed. It's good. All right, Gladys, help me out real quick. Now, and don't don't start leaving no bad comments. All right, guys, this is this is called getting culture. All right, when in Rome, when you come to places, you can't knock the food. You just gotta try it. So yeah, that cricket is actually not bad. I had a cockroach a few years back, and all of the like the wings were stuck in between my teeth. Now this here is a like some sort of worm. Those are nice, but look, as you can see, the locals love it. Like, this isn't a tourist thing. The scorpions you see on Kaosan Road, that's for tourists. This here, worms, I could get down with this. Let me know down in the comment section if you guys will get down with the worms or not. Gladys, you want some? Please. Oh. Those are good. They're good, huh? Yeah. It tastes like potato chips. Get, get you a girl that can yeah. eat some worms with you. They're good ones. <laughs> All right. Well, let's continue on now with our little tour. Let's see what else they got. Look, they got fresh fruit over here in this direction. More papaya salad. More of the crabs. You know what I could really go for right now? That I think will complement the papaya salad well? What? Some skewers. The, the papaya salad is almost gone. Wow, you have destroyed that. <laughs> <laughs> and also my lips are almost gone. <laughs> yeah, I can imagine because mine were on fire. Oh, you know what they have here? Raw tea. Should we do raw tea? Do or should we do something a little bit more salty first then Maybe go for the, the sweet? Skewers. All right, let's find some skewers then. Those are always a great option when in Thailand. Yeah, you're right about that. So actually over here they got like uh, chicken tenders, chicken fries, fried squid. Hello. Yeah, what kind of chicken do you have? This is Tom Yum flavored chicken. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. One, Let me do one. Uh, Why not? Here you go, baby. Can you hold this? Man, I feel so bad. I got Gladys holding everything uh, right now. Oh, I just pick it up. Uh, Thank you. Let's put this there. Oh, this looks delicious. You know what? We'll do one Tom Yum and we'll do... This is barbecue? Yeah, and what is... Cheese? Yeah. And this one? Original. Original. Which one's the most famous? Even. Even. They're all the good. All right. I'll do Tom Yum and I'll do barbecue. There you go, sir. Put it here. Okay. Oh. Whatever one you like, sauce. Sauce. Um, ketchup. 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 Yeah. I'll do ketchup, please. These here are the 10 baht coins, so. Here you go, sir. Thank you. Kapunka. Oh man, this looks delicious. Thank you. All right, this is definitely the way we gotta get, we gotta get this uh, food tour going. All right, so these here are Tom Yum and barbecue chicken tenders. Haroi chin chin. Wow. Yo, the Tom Yum one is nothing to play with. This is God's creation, people. This is delicious. Uh. Wow. You know what? <laughs> Gladys is eating everything with me. Okay. You got to try that Tom Yum. That's barbecue. Is this a Tom Yum? Barbecue. Mm -hmm. This is, is this the tom yum? That's the tom yum. Okay. Yo, that's mean, huh? That's one good chicken tender. You know what? This one's slap. <laughs> Gladys, I don't know where she comes up with these things. The whole slaps and smacks thing. I don't know what's the difference. How do you know if it slaps or if it smacks? You just know in your heart. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. You know what? Hey, 
bad. We're about to destroy it. all of this. Are you gonna keep holding the food Don't for me? Don't feel bad. I, all right. In my other life, I was a um, really good waitress. <laughs> okay. You know those that grab like 10 dishes in one hand? 10 dishes in one hand. What have we had so far? We've got some mealworms. Yeah. We've got some papaya salad, some chicken tenders, a coconut smoothie. Oh, we're going strong. We're going strong. But you know what? I think no street food video in Thailand is complete without something sweet. And my go-to sweet is the roti. Now Gladys's go-to sweet is mango sticky rice. Mango sticky Order. rice, which you also can't go wrong with. Hello, sir. Is this yours too? No, she left. Five minutes. Five minutes. Okay, I'll be back. We'll come back to the roti. Now you know what? How about I just give you guys a little tour of this um, whole area? Oh no way! Look at what they got over there. Ooh, the scores we try in Tokyo. Yeah, the sh you know what, guys? I'm gonna take you over there right now. That's what we're gonna do right now. I know Gladys. If I can reward Gladys for one of those strawberry skewers, she'll hold all the food all night long. So. <laughs> Now don't no don't be what man it's because people are, some people are haters in the comments like don't don't start leaving comments like oh you made Gladys hold all of your food guys no no I'm fine. these are things these are things that we discussed prior to coming on out and we I, I do the same thing for her videos and she yes. does the same thing for mine it's the only way this kind of works you, you know what I mean help you need when, help when filming so don't be do don't 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 be spreading negative vibes there's no need for that all right we're all having fun I was about to say that you can even get your manicure here. It's amazing. Dude, you can even get a tattoo here. It's crazy. <laughs> all right, so these here are the famous strawberries with um, all kinds of sugar on top. Hello, how are you? Um, how much are the strawberry sticks? 50 baht. This one's 40. Which one do you recommend? All of them. <laughs> okay, you know what? Let me try this one with the grape. It's a grape, right? Grapes? Yeah, great. Okay, I, I'll try this one. That looks delicious. Oh, you dipped that in. Is that sugar? Sugar, wow. So it goes, it gets another coat of sugar. And I think right here she's actually um, like cooking the sugar into like a, a caramelized sugar. Oh, that looks amazing. Wow, thank you so much. Man, this here is this is street food heaven here in Tokyo in Tokyo. Oh man, I got I got taken back to, to to Japan because this is where we had them. Um I think this is a Japanese creation or a Korean creation. Is this Korean? Japanese? Uh, Korea. Korea, right? Man, Korea, they make all the crazy food. They got the uh, different colored corn dogs and um, all kinds of crazy things, but yeah, this here is street food heaven in Bangkok, guys. Not, not Tokyo. All right, I'm just, I'm still in Tokyo at some points in my days. Sometimes I want some quiet space, and I'm like, oh, I wish I was in Tokyo. And then I get a little bit bored, and I'm like, nah, I'm perfectly fine with being in Bangkok, baby. There's no, never a dull moment here. All right. Say it again, and did I didn't listen? Street food heaven in. Oh yeah yeah yeah. This is street food heaven in Thailand. <laughs> All right. This here is the um, caramelized sugar coated strawberries. We got some grapes, uh, both green and purple. <laughs> you know what? I feel like you might get diabetes. You eat a lot of these, but. You might not also because there is some fruit in there. <laughs> so, you know what? Let's actually help Gladys out right now because she's full. She got the hands <laughs> full. Um, hmm. The only chip? No. Oh. <laughs> I'm writing chip. <laughs> Thank you. All right. Yeah, these are going down right now. <laughs> Gladys ain't holding no strawberries with sugar. Uh-uh. Oh, man. You know what? Here, let me give you the strawberry. And I'll get the grape. That's only fair, right, guys? Mm. 
Wow. Mm -mm -mm. You know what? I almost like the grape better, I think. The grape is delicious. I think I almost like the grape better. No, strawberry was very good too. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Here, let me hold this shake for a second. Yeah, I need, okay. that, I need that refreshment back in my life real quick. Oh man, they got Thai pancakes cooking up. All kinds of seafood. More skewers. And then over here they got the um, the live music. Woo! Man, they're playing the tune, so I actually had to just make a cut in the video. I already had to mentally note that because we just spent way too long listening to that music. But yeah, look, they got the nail salon active right now. All kinds of other snacks being sold. Oh, wow, look, they even have the sushi bars open today. That looks nice. And then what they got going on over here? Oh, these are like esquites, corn with um, condensed milk. Wow, that is awesome. And of course, you can't be anywhere in Thailand without any uh, beauty items being sold. They got all kinds of makeup, clothing. Oh no. Gladys in our natural habitat. <laughs> yeah, I love the bazaars too. They're awesome. You know what though? Let's actually work our way back over here towards that roti that we were waiting for. Now these are actually like some of my favorite stands in Thailand where you can actually like choose your vegetables and your meats and they grill them for you over here in this direction but that's a little time consuming process oh man i know what you're looking at right now <laughs> this girl loves these hello. hello these are pork right yeah okay um three for 20 yeah okay i'll take three please yeah. oh yeah i saw your eyes light up these are gladys's favorite skewers what's their name Moving. I love moving. Moving, haroi ching ching. Mui bing. No, no bag. It's okay. We're gonna destroy these right now. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh no no no! Come here, girl. <laughs> Come here. I love them. I love how much these make Gladys smile, dude. You gotta get your. Trust me, for all you ladies watching, you guys can vouch for me. For all you men watching, you need to get yourself a girl that loves to eat. Because then you're going to live a happy life, my friends. I'll tell you what. Mm. No. This one's perfect with the papaya salad. Yeah. No. That is bomb. You know what? Here. Take that one, but as soon as we're done with this video... Yeah, we're coming back there for a few more of those, huh? Yeah, that goes well with the papaya salad. They're sweet. They are. They're sweet. They're delicious. All right. You know what? Oh, look. There's there's more here. M Mo Bing, Mo, Mo Bing. Mo Bing. <laughs> Very delicious. Thank you. All right. Well, the roti lady is back. Let's get our roti. Hello. You make the most famous roti. <laughs> you make the famous Thai roti. <laughs> no, she. All right. I'm just gonna say it's the most famous. Can I? Can I try one? Um, banana, roti banana. Look, she has roti banana, banana um, with Nutella, banana and cheese, egg and Nutella. All kinds of good creations. Let's see if I can't show you guys exactly how she gets down on the roti. Thai people love roti. It's amazing. And as I mentioned, it's one of my favorite desserts. So yeah, basically she gets the, fla the ball of the uh, flour used for the roti and she beats it. It's quite an interesting system to be fair. I've always found it very interesting. And then of course it goes right onto the oil. Oh, I'd burn myself if I tried that. 
Oh no, power went off. There has been a power outage at the night market. <laughs> well, good thing we're at the Roddy stand and towards the end. Oh man, that sucks, huh? Roddy doesn't get a pressure because... Yeah. Because the propane, yeah. <laughs> Arroy Chin Chin. <laughs> oh, yeah, you can't forget the butter, guys. Nope. That is how you do it right there. Look at that butter on top of that roti. When you and say, the smell, huh? When you say with the cherry on the top, you should definitely change that, but with butter on the top. Yeah, true, true. <laughs> you gotta have that, that, that fat. Mac. That fat, I don't even know how I'm gonna say it right now. That fat, uh, that, that fat piece of butter, butter on top. Oh man, guys, sorry. When I, guys, I suffer from fat boy syndrome. When I, when I start smelling stuff like this, I forget how to talk. Man, my legs get weak. Everything. <laughs> <laughs> this is crazy, crazy good. Let me know if you guys suffer from the same problems. Or is it just a meat problem? I do look. <laughs> look oh that. My oh my god, you smell it. <laughs> and then I love how they cut it up with some scissors. Yeah, buddy. Yes, sir. This is how you get down in Thailand. You gotta try a little bit of everything when you're at the night markets. And then of course they they dribble some condensed milk on top. Oh man. Papun Ka. Beautiful, beautiful. Yeah, beautiful. Oh man. Woo! This smells super good. Alright, let's move on over to some light. Hopefully that footage is alright, man. You oh! The lights just turned back on. It just wanted to give me a rough time tonight. Alright, you know what? Here you go. I'll let you be the first one to sample this bad boy. Oh, thank you so much. Because I seen them legs, them legs shaking. Sugar in my my body. <laughs> mm. Is that Can delicious? It? It's crispy. You know what? Can you help me with this one? Of course. Because no. it's kind of hard. We got our hands full right now. Okay. Oh, man. Big bites. Woo. You know what? I'm glad I went with that choice because usually we go with the the banana Nutella mix, but yeah. sometimes ooh, sometimes the Nutella is a little bit too much with the condensed milk. Sometimes it's a little, a little uh, too much of a larger dose of diabetes at once. Yeah, you know what? This this here is like doable. It's nice. Well, you know what? I think this is going to bring this little street food video to an end. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this little adventure. If you guys want to check out this market, it's called The Street Rachada. When in Bangkok. It's one of the best ones out there. A lot of locals, very little tourists. And the Jobs Fair is obviously the most uh, popular. But it's also um, a lot more expensive as well. Uh, all the prices at that market are usually around double than what you're seeing here. So keep that in mind. And Gladys, thank you so much for joining me and for helping me eat all this food. Now, let's go get some more pork skewers and sit down and destroy this papaya salad. Let's Cause I'm go. hungry, hungry. <laughs> you were always smarter. I was the one to tag along.